Event three, teams. Three rounds of three minute EMA. Minute one, 50 seconds max pull-ups or ring rows. Minute two, 50 seconds synchro alternating forward lunges or goblet squats. Minute three, 50 seconds synchro line facing burpees. At 3, 2, 1, go, one athlete will step up to the bar or the rings and complete as many pull-ups or ring rows as possible in 50 seconds. The team will then prepare for the next movement. Once the one minute timer beeps, all three athletes will perform as many synchro alternating forward lunges or goblet squats as possible in 50 seconds. The team will then prepare for the next movements. Once the one minute timer beeps, all three athletes will complete as many synchro line facing burpees as possible in 50 seconds. The team will then start from the beginning and complete this work for a total of three rounds in nine minutes. Score is total reps. Pull-ups, intermediate. Strict, kipping, or butterfly are allowed. Pull-ups begin with the athlete in full arm extension and feet not touching anything. The chin must go above the bar before descending to full arm extension. No rep. No rep includes the chin not going above the bar, the feet touching anything, the arms not being fully extended in the down position or using the jump to the bar as momentum for the first rep. If a jump is required to get to the bar, the athlete must first dead hang with arms fully extended before beginning reps. Ring rows, novice and masters. Rings will have been pre-adjusted so the bottom of the ring is 40 inches from the floor. A piece of tape will be on the floor directly below the rings. The athlete will begin with the back of their heels on the far side of the tape, furthest away from the hands and gripping the rings. The athlete will bend their knees and lean back without their feet moving. The athlete is in a proper position when the toes are up, heels are the only part of the foot touching the ground, or the feet are flat with heels not touching the line and the body in a straight line from ankle to neck with arms fully extended. Without kipping or losing the rigid body position, the athlete will pull their chest toward the rings. A rep is completed when the hands break the plane of the chest. No rep. No rep includes not having the body in a rigid line from ankle to neck and the rings not breaking the plane of the chest. Synchro alternating forward lunges in immediate. All three athletes will begin by standing tall and side by side. The team will then interlock elbows of teammates with outside athletes having one free arm and the middle athlete having both arms interlocked with teammates' arms. All three athletes will then begin by lunging forward, only forward and touching their back knee to the ground at the same time and return back to the standing position with feet back in line and hips and knees fully extended. All three knees must touch the ground at the same time before standing back up and arms must always be interlocked for repetitions to be counted. The movement will be considered synchro at two points. When all three athletes back knee is touching the floor and all three athletes are standing fully upright. Synchro goblet squats, novice and masters. All three athletes will begin standing fully upright with the knees and hips extended, holding the kettlebell horns upright and the kettlebell at a height between the chest and neck. While maintaining the kettlebell grip position, the athletes will lower their hip crease to below the knee and stand back up to the fully upright position for each rep. The movement will be considered synchro at two points, when all three athletes' hip crease is below the knee and all three athletes are standing fully upright. Line facing burpees. Line facing burpees must be performed perpendicular to and facing the line. Athletes may jump or step back to reach the bottom position. Chest and thighs must touch the ground with the head behind the line. Standing and or jumping back to the starting position are both permitted. Intermediates must jump over the line using a two foot takeoff. Navis and masters single leg jump or stepping over the line is permitted. For three person teams, all three athletes must have their chest and thighs on the ground at the same time and jump over the line at the same time. Score is total reps completed.